What's good, guys? If you need cheap, fast, reliable MT and you are sick and tired of getting scammed by 2K's packs, make sure you hand over to my sponsor. They're running an insane Christmas deal. Use code BUGS for 5% off or actually 8% off at checkout right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video. And guys, today we're going over to market. As per usual, before we do get into the video, make sure to smash that like button. Let's hit 50 likes on this video for 100,000 MT giveaway, man. Make sure to like it up, sub it up. If you guys do need cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit me up on Instagram and or Twitter. And um, that's pretty much it. So guys, today we are going to go over some investments. What's good with the market? Is it crashed or is it not? Um, if you guys could please, man, make sure to like it up, sub it up if you're new. We're on the road to 14K. Shout out to all the people that subscribed. Two to 13,000. If you guys could also please sub to the new channel on trading cards. I do open packs there. I go over investments for trading cards and all that good stuff. But yo, without further ado, let's get into the market. So packs are still live. They're gone in five days. My now here's a little tip. Here's a little tip. All right. Don't be fooled, guys. 2K is going to release super packs again uh Tuesday. There's going to be a giant mark crash. So right now, let's see if the market is crashed. Let's go to Pink Dine Sheep and see what P Maravich is out because literally. He's honestly, yeah. Okay, so look at this. Um, there's not a lot of P Maravich's up there now. P Maravich has rose up a tiny bit, which means the market is gonna slowly, slowly rise. Um, so here we go. So he's at oh actually, he's at like 15k, then he's at like 70k. So let's check out some other cards. Let's check out KD. Let's see what, what's good with the idle set. Let's see what's happening over there. Uh for Galaxy with Chris Weber. KD's up a lot, Dominique's up a lot, Mono Ginobili's up a lot. Like I said, that's why I said don't panic. The set will rise. Let's check out Manu Ginobili. Um, there's usually like none of on the auction. Usually. It looks like he's around 60 something K. Um, which is the dub because we got him for, look at that. He's over 50, 65 K. We got him for 50 K. We got three of them for 50 K. Sold two at around 70 something. And look at this. So he's around 70 K. Listen, I think he's going to keep rising. This set, there's, they're never going to be re-released in packs unless they screw us and re-release it Tuesday. But right now, guys, this set is going to rise. Dominique Wilkins already. Oh, I put him up for 100K. He's already up. He's already up too. Listen, this set is going to rise. If you want to sell now, you can make MT. If you don't want to sell now, you don't have to. You could wait a little bit longer. Now, we're going to go over the, another filter, another tip for you guys. Seasons of giving. Let's see what's going on with the cheap pink diamonds like Jay Rich, Jason Williams, and all of them. And uh, look at this, man. They dropped again. I really think that this set might go up a little bit more like it's worth maybe investing in one or two see what's going on it's not a bad investment honestly um honestly there's a very low chance they continue to drop they're probably not gonna be in packs again unless like now nah, they'll probably be in packs tuesday so you might be able to want to pick up some pat some cards up tuesday literally try to sell honestly try to sell your whole entire squad today um today or tomorrow's not a bad day literally any card if you have any questions man let me know down below in the comments um, let's look at Hidu Turkulu, man. A key investment, as per usual, man. We always go over the man Hidu Turkulu, the man, the myth, the legend. Look at this, 5K Hidu Turkulu, guys. 4,500 and 5K. Look at this, man. Hidu Turkulu looking like a very, very good investment for me personally. Um, I think this Hidu Turkulu is a pretty damn good investment, if you ask me, man. For 5K, you literally cannot go wrong. So honestly, I do have a lot. I'm gonna throw up some for 5k. I got most of mine for 3,500 and under. If I sell them for 5k, I'm gonna make a solid 1,000 MT per, which is not bad at all. 1,000 MT per is free MT if you did listen to me. Um, we're gonna check out the man, the myth, the legend, Eddie Curry. Um, as you guys know, the 2k20 GOAT. And he's actually code for 3,200, so he was 1,500 MT. I say he might rise even a little bit more later in the day, but I'm going to sell some now to make some extra MT. I'm going to make around 1500, a little bit over 1500, even after the reduction. So in my opinion, this card right here is going to make us some solid MT. Pretty good card. Not going to lie. Very good card, actually. And if you guys didn't know, we made a lot of profit off my pack opening this week. Uh, Magic Johnson ended up selling for 750K. Don't ask me how. I have no idea how. So that's insane um penny hardaway's down man all the xp challenge cards are down a ton now what happens when season three comes around all these cards in season two do end up rising a ton right after super packs so if you guys want to make lots and lots of mt you can invest in some cards any literally any card you want any card you think of is going to rise in season two honestly 
One card that I feel like might rise a ton after two packs is most likely this Larry Bird. This Larry Bird card is absolutely insane. Um, very good card, good on defense, amazing shooter, decent at dunking. Just he's just a stud. It's Larry Bird, 6'9 small forward. You can't go wrong. Literally, <coughs> you can't go wrong with this card. I say he does rise up in value. And as people keep getting weights, some people aren't gonna get keep winning, getting weights. So top point guards from the season are also gonna rise. Uh, I think Magic Johnson might rise to four something. Derrick Rose already rose. He was like 170. He's had 224 with nine minutes left, guys. A lot of cards are gonna rise. Another card, another card that I feel like might rise. It is risky though. Pink diamonds are never really worth investing in because it's risky. Um, but I think Penny Hardaway. He's gonna be in super packs. If you can get him for a decent price, maybe around I don't know 70k. That's a pretty good value. Uh, I want to buy it, but I want to wait till super packs. Right now is not the time to invest. Right now is really just the time. Sell off the squad, guys. Sell off everything you got. Even Giannis, man. Giannis is up. Every single card on the market is up a lot. You guys just have to sell your cards. Um, even the Amethyst cheapest filter, man. Bismack Biyombo is going for a good amount. That card is terrible. He's an absolutely terrible center. And this card's up double. Like, it's crazy that this terrible card... Is up to 3,000 MT. The Bismack Biombo card is so garbage. The fact that he's up 3,000 to 3,000 MT <clears throat> is absolutely crazy. So, any investments you have, some investments you have, you could sell, you could wait. I'm selling some, I'm keeping some. That's what I usually do. And then let's check out Irving. Irving was dirt cheap not too long ago either. Same with Kyrie. Same with everybody in that whole Pantheon set, man. That set is up a lot it's a very good time to sell every time you see amethysts that are cheap man you gotta take advantage it's easy cash it's easy money uh let's see julius irving's up a ton man what is he at julius irving's at 4,900. we got him for around 3,500 or less and look at that so we're gonna make some mt off that as well guys the, today's a seller's market man if you want to make mt very 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 easily make sure to do this very easy MT, easy, easy MT. Same with Tom G, same with D Rust. They all went up a lot. So now's the time to sell. And you could also snipe them because their price did go up. People probably think about the old price and you can make some good MT. But yo, other than that, man, hope you guys did enjoy the video. We're going to have another video on this channel. And then we're going to have another video on the second channel. I do have a little busy day today. So I don't know. Um, can't really. I'm about to get Baron Davis. Just got to get Vlad. And then I got to get Aaron Gore today. Kind of taking a break off 2K this week. Just chilling out. And um, yeah, that's all we got for the vid. Hope you guys did enjoy. Have a good one. Peace.